Hoo-hoo, everyone. First, we go over my stats and what I've done last week. Then we will proceed to my plan how I will become a better writer. I'm Joanne and Jan. I write web fiction. Check it out. So, first my stats. I've got great progress uh, with the platform webnovel.com. I got chosen on one of their feature uh, pages and that drew a lot of new readers to my story. I got 20, 30, maybe 50 readers in the last week and uh, that's just uh, wonderful. <laughs> At Royal Roads, my readers are growing, albeit growing slowly, but that's um, okay. But the subscriptions sank a bit, or the curve is leveling out a bit at the moment, and the rating definitely sank by a whole lot. The reason is now my story is in a phase where the plot is not that apparent. I think I said that very nicely because my story hasn't that much of a plot. I tried very desperately to add a bit of plot a few chapters ago and it worked like a charm. The subscriptions uh, rose and everything looked fine, but now we are more in a preparatory stage. Yeah, people like plot. I don't know why. I don't like plot. The same goes for my Patreon subscribers. I've got three or four new subscribers in that phase where the plot was hot, but now in the last few chapters no more uh, new subscribers. Yeah, I mean plot, 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 plot. Plot, what plot? <laughs> no, my story won't go in this direction. Uh, okay, if you don't know what plot, what plot means, it's it's a term for stories focused on marital activities or maybe extramarital <laughs> activities. So uh, yeah, fucking and such things. We are speaking about porn. So plot, what plot? Uh, no, you can do stories without plot or with just a tiny sprinkle of plot, even without pawn. Read my story, Auntie Toes, the Via MMORPG. Good, that was it to my stats. Next is what I did last week. I made great progress on my animation skills. I made one really, really good animation and one fine animation. I can't show it to you yet because um, I made them for Carol Brown and she has of course the first right to publish these clips. I will show it uh, to you as soon as I have her permission. Uh, I'm looking forward to bragging about them. I think they're, they're um, yeah, I wrote a bit, still not as much as I like, but um, I stayed on schedule, so yeah, let's say it's fine. Now to my plan to become a better writer. A friend of mine suggested that uh, you can learn a lot by just copying other writers. And with copying I don't mean like uh, copying their style or copying their work schedule like Kate Kavanagh does, but uh, copying their actual books word for word. And I thought this was a great suggestion because this is a very established way to become a better painter, to uh, redraw pictures, because if you do it step by step, then you will know more about the handicraft, the craftsmanship of the story than by just reading it. You will notice more about it. And um, I believe this is uh, very true because I get sucked in very <laughs> hard 
and then I notice nothing but what uh, is happening in the story. So I will try this and I will make a series out of it. How long the series will get depends on how successful the method is. So you can look forward to the first episode of the series soon, maybe Friday. We'll see Friday or Sunday how it goes. Good, this is my plan for next week. Oh, yeah. <sighs> I always forget this YouTube thingy. Subscribe to my channel, comment about which writing tip, uh, which uh, writing advice helped you the most to reach a different level on your writing. They are sometimes just these key advices and most of the time you knew it beforehand but the way they worded it or just the way the person said it to you sometimes you get these uh, in German we call them aha moments, moments because you go ah yeah uh, I read the uh, book on writing about writing by Stephen King it's great writing advice and he had such a moment when an editor told him that he doesn't have to add more words while editing but to delete more words and for him it was like ah I mean, it's very specific because um, for people who tend to underwrite, for them it's better to add words. But he is apparently an overwriter, so it helped him to condense uh, his story more. Yeah, so uh, yeah, see you soon. Ciao!